What we have here is the Raswick Wireless Inventors Kit for the Raspberry Pi. Now this is uh, from Siseco. Here's the actual web address. Now basically this is a complete experimenter's kit so if you've actually come new into the Raspberry Pi or particularly into the idea of remote control or wireless control um, projects this is a very good introduction where basically the complete setup that you require in order to make successful projects is already in this one box. Now we're just going to open this and uh, start on some projects. Now we've opened up the actual package we can see our contents which is uh, very thoughtfully packaged and laid out and actually labelled. Now we go around here and first up is obviously the packaging list so you can see there we have quite a large number of components in our actual kit mostly resistors and capacitors etc but actually still quite a large number of items secondly are the two modules, now this is the Raspberry Pi module as you see a small sub-module mounted onto the actual Raspberry Pi GPIO carrier board and the same module again on what is basically a uh, Arduino Uno I believe uh, called the Xeno IRF and this is where the actual hardware sketches will be run communicating via the radio to the Raspberry Pi. Next up in the kit is the SD card, now this has been pre-programmed with the uh, specific drivers, kernel requirements and other software you'll need in order to actually do the experiments and communicate to the card successfully first time. Now this doesn't actually promote, meaning you can't actually do this with whatever release, say Raspbian or Noobs or whatever else, just that this is actually pre-done and you're guaranteed to actually get working straight away. Next up obviously something quite simple there, this is just the four, 470 ohm resistors which seem to have quite a few of no doubt for LEDs, etc, etc. And they're up, are the LEDs. Quite a few, quite nice little LEDs, just for indication purposes. Then, at the back, we have a breadboard, some tactile switches, a pot. We have uh, what looks like a uh, photodiode, and uh, we also should have, I believe, a Fermista. Here's the PZM. Be the case, I mean, if you actually can need to find out what's in there, they were all in here. You can actually see them all marked. It's very simple, very easy to use. Next up, some 10K resistors. And then, finally, in the kit, are some mail to mail hookup wire in order to take from the actual. Arduino into the breadboard for the experiments. Okay, you're still going to need a Raspberry Pi, which of course you've either owned or you're going to get from, uh, say, Farnell or RS or any other supplier. Now, Siseco supply this kit, and this is everything you require, except for obviously the Raspberry Pi, in order to perform 17 pre-worked experiments and then subsequently another 15 or more which are basically guided experiments where you learn to program yourself and this is where we're going to go. We're going to start on now on the first of the 17 actual experiments so you can see how all this kit goes together.